If you're a middle school math teacher wanting to be a better teacher, stick around because I'm spilling the secrets on my number one thing you should be doing to be a better educator. If you are new around here, my name is Kathy Martin and I help 6th, 7th, 8th grade and Algebra 1 teachers experience more aha math moments with their students and save time and money with their lesson planning and middle school math resources. Okay, so I won't keep you in suspense any longer. What is the secret to becoming a better math teacher? Can you guess? If you guessed reflection, then you'd be correct. It's essential for middle school math teachers to take the time to reflect on their experiences, celebrate success, and identify areas of growth. Reflective practices is a powerful tool for professional development. It allows us to evaluate teaching strategies, assess student learning, and make informed decisions for the future of our classroom. So what the heck should we reflect on, right? <laughs> okay, so let's dive into some of these th some of the categories of areas of where you should be reflecting. Number one, review student data and assessment. Look, test scores aren't everything, okay? But we should be looking at our student data, test scores, assessment, student work samples, all encompassing to help us see any trends, patterns in our student performance, right? We can take this information. Generally, I take it with a grain of salt because I want to see where the kids are at today, you know, but it gives me an idea of where they've been. Okay, number two, self-reflection. Engage in honest self-reflection to evaluate your teaching practices, classroom management, and instructional strategies. Consider what you could improve upon. Reflect on your lesson planning process, how you've taught certain concepts. Maybe the way that you taught something this past school year went really, really well and you want to keep it up. Or maybe it didn't go so well, so you got to think to yourself, okay, how am I going to change it, right? And then were some of the things that you did more engaging for students? And then were some of the things that you did less engaging? Let's do more of what worked, okay? So some questions that you can ask yourself in this area is, did I effectively scaffold learning to meet the needs of my kids? Did I provide ample opportunity for student participation um, and for them to ask questions? And number three, did I, or there's actually four. Number three is, did I incorporate technology to enhance our learning? And then four, what adjustments can I make to support struggling students in my class? Then I want you to reflect on your areas of strengths and weaknesses. We all have them. What are your areas of strengths and weaknesses? Think about all of your strengths all the things that went well this school year, and I want you to celebrate them. We have to celebrate the wins, right? And then think about some areas of weaknesses that happened over the school year. Be specific, right? Let's find some areas to improve. Let's set some goals on these areas and then see what happens. And finally, the last area of reflection. How is your current curriculum? Do you have curriculum? Take a look at what you have and what you don't have and see what you need to fill in the gaps. If you need more support, the Pre-Algebra Teachers Math Membership is here to help you because having high quality, engaging resources is going to help every area of your reflective process and it's gonna help every area of your classroom, right? If we have crappy resources or no resources, how do we expect kids to learn and be engaged? So take a look at your, your curriculum, see what you have, see what you don't have. If you're looking for a one-stop shop for everything you need to teach 6th, 7th, 8th grade and Algebra 1 math, come and join us inside the Pre-Algebra Teachers Math Membership. Log in, grab what you need, and teach with success. All you have to do is click the link below and join now. Can't wait to see you inside our community. Bye for now.